How to manually enable Redpilling on Windows 10. Here's how to manually enable Redpilling on Windows 10. 1. Install the KB4482887 update at http colon slash slash bit.ly slash 2vwgpiw. 2. 2.1 for client SKUs, stock keeping units, users, do with the following registry configuration updates. Reg at HKLM backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash session manager backslash memory management slash V feature settings override slash T reg underscore D word slash D zero X four hundred reg at HKLM backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash session manager backslash memory management slash V feature settings override mask slash T reg underscore D word slash D zero X four hundred reboot your machine later. Two point two on server SKUs. Reg at HKLM backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash session manager backslash memory management slash V feature settings override slash T reg underscore D word slash D zero X four hundred reg at HKLM backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash session manager backslash memory management slash V feature settings override mask slash T reg underscore D word slash D zero X four oh one reboot three verify red balloon status via get speculation control settings PowerShell template Speculation control settings for CVE 2017-5715 branch target injection hardware support for branch target injection mitigation is present, true Windows OS support for branch target injection mitigation is present, true Windows OS support for branch target injection mitigation is enabled, true. BTI kernel repelling enabled, true BTI kernel import optimization enabled, true. Last but not least, over the coming months, the repelling as part of phased rollout via cloud configuration. Due to the complexity of the implementation and changes involved, we are only enabling Redpilling performance benefits for Windows 10, version 1809 and later releases. Up, http colon slash slash bit.ly slash 2 uskjfh. Mitigating Spectre Variant 2 with Redpilling on Windows.